Hey y'all, it's your girl Kendria Mecca, as always, in these streets. Well, no, actually, right now, I'm not in these streets. Right now, I'm in this studio, the Mech Tech studio, putting the last bit of elbow grease on the latest episode of State of the Arts. Stick around for more information on that. But first, it's the word on the street from in these tweets. The streets are talking about Freedom Rhymers, Democracy NC's third annual arts event going down tonight, Wednesday, July 23rd at 7 p.m. at Red at 28th. You are welcome to come out and join us or just sit back and get your soul fed by national, international, and Emmy Award winning artists all celebrating the 50th anniversary of Freedom Summer. We know that sometimes business owners, promoters, and independent artists have to do it on the cheap, but we got your back in these tweets. Follow us on social media at In These Tweets and find out about our low rates starting at $75. State of the Arts is back for a second season. Check out these clips from the next episode of State of the Arts with Kendria Mecca. And I'm always seeking uh, the narrative. Juan was a blind submission. I had never seen his work. Um, and I saw the images and I was, of course, immediately drawn. Uh, no matter how deeply I looked at one of the pieces, that narrative was as, was as deep as I wanted to go. And his message is so strong. Oftentimes when people do highly political work, um, it's so strongly in your face that you end up preaching to the choir. But with Juan's work, no matter who you are, you're immediately drawn in by the sheer beauty of the work. And then you get the narrative, and that narrative is so strong and so important. And that's the word on the street from Mech Techs in these streets.